What is up, YouTube? It's Kazmir. I'm back with The Walking Dead. We're starting a new episode today, and man, the things kind of take a turn. I can't believe that David's still alive, and I'm really wondering what his people are going to think when when they find out that they basically shot his his daughter in the head, and shot his wife, and it's just, I don't know. It just, it just seems kind of weird and interesting, and it's a pretty interesting twist. Caught me off guard. Um, I'm a little bit worried about him, though. He's kind of unhinged if you look at all the flashbacks and stuff like that. And he doesn't really seem to like, uh, Yavi or whatever. Um, but yeah, let's, let's start the next episode and see what trouble we can get into this time. So this must be another flashback towards the earlier days. There it is. Let's take it and go. She's kind of a train wreck. Of course it's empty. Why would we get that lucky? Hey, keep it down. I know it sucks, Kate, but you gotta watch out. I'm sorry. I'm just sick of this shit. I just thought this one time we deserve to catch a fucking break. You want to help? All right, we'll just do it with the concrete. Gross. Does she know the kid or is she just freaking out because it's a kid? Girl, you married? I'm not interested. So uh, we're just camping out at home? I know we all wanted to stay here in the house and wait for David to come back. But it's been three months since he drove away with your mom. What are you saying? We're not safe here. Not anymore. 
You and I could have been killed out there for an empty can. There's got to be a safer place out there. Somewhere not so isolated. Time to go. We'll leave. Go somewhere else. Somewhere safer. Somewhere with crazy thick walls, okay? And a gate that's 20 feet tall. You really think the kids are going to be happy with this plan? The kids will understand. A and if they don't, we'll just make them see it our way. We have to go. How come? What if I don't want to leave? Cave. We're safe inside the house. I and I bet we can find more food in the neighborhood if we just look harder. We're tired of being afraid every time we leave you guys alone. And it's just getting worse out there. Better to leave now while we still can. What about Dad? What's he gonna think if he shows up and we, we just ditched him? We might never find him again. We have to look out for ourselves now, Gabe. I wish things were different, but our safety is more important. But we're safe here. No, we're not. I'm sorry, Gabe, but Javi's right. Uh, how about you guys go and I stay here? You're a kid. That's not how it works. I can take care of myself. If I need any help, I'll just ask my friends. With the dead one on the street? Honey. What? What's, what's wrong with her? Why is she acting so weird? Uncle Javi? Nothing's wrong with her. She's just a, a little shook up. That's all. We can't lie to him, Javi. He needs to know. Will you guys just tell me what's going on? Your friend, Drew, from down the street, he... he didn't make it. He... he turned into one of them. So you understand why, don't you? Why we have to leave? If that happened to you, I couldn't bear it. When do we have to go? Tomorrow, as soon as it's daylight. I want to leave him a note. I'll help you get started. Okay? What are we going to tell him? I want to say something good. Just tell him we love him. All of us. And nothing's going to change that. Not ever. I like that. I'm going to write it right now, so we don't forget. Of course. I'll help him. Thank you. Really. He's a military man. Episode 3.
Dad? Javi? Is that really you? <laughs> I always hoped I'd find you. I never really thought it happened. Not after all this time. God, you have no idea how good it is to see your face. I think I got a pretty decent idea, actually. I knew you were still alive. I knew it. Hey, weapons down. This is my family. You gotta let us in. Kate doesn't have much longer. Jesus. Kate! David? I'm here, honey. I'm right here. What the hell happened? She's been shot. We got the bullet out, but she's still bleeding. We need your doctor. Now, David. What the fuck is she on the ground for? She's barely got a pulse. She's cold as fucking ice. How are you just gonna leave her here like this? He said we had to kneel. I couldn't hold on to her. The fuck you trying to prove, Max? They're outsiders, David. It's what we do with everybody. She's coming inside. But she hasn't been checked. Fuck that. This is my wife. I... I didn't know. Honest. She's going to the hospital. Now. Our doctor's gonna help you, honey. I'm gonna make sure of it. Wait, I I'm going with you. Sorry, but the rest of you have to go straight to quarantine. What for? All newcomers get checked for bites, and they all have to answer a couple of questions. Our doctor will clear the two of them, but the rest of you have to come with me to the quarantine holding area. It's how we keep it safe for everyone. Sure, why not? Let's just get this over with. Javi. Make my job easy, would you? Listen to your friend. <sighs> Whatever you say. Well, we got her help. Let's just... Let's go. Just move on. for help and this happened I've been so worried about Kate I told them she needed a doctor they promised me someone would look into it please tell me they found her well luckily we found her before she got any worse they just took her to the hospital I can't believe no one went to look for her I'm sorry Javi really but I didn't have any reason not to believe them What? The people here in Richmond. They're New Frontier. Oh my god. Oh, 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 you ain't even heard the worst part yet. One of them's his brother. Rot roll. I didn't even know you had a brother, Javi. Hey, nobody's more surprised than me. I thought the guy was dead. We haven't seen David in years. It's just been me. Kate and the kids this whole time. I don't even want to think about what the odds are, but he did seem pretty damn surprised to see you. Whoever this guy is, he can't be all bad, right? I mean, he helped Kate instead of hauling her down here. Of course he brought her inside. She's his damn wife. You're kidding. Kate is married to your brother? The way you two acted around each other. I just didn't think she had a husband out there, is all. The only reason I know Kate is because she married David. I was the best man at their wedding. Wow. Okay. Family drama aside, hope you know I'm not about to make nice with New Frontier. I know you didn't have much stake in Prescott, Javi, but they burned that place to the ground for no fucking reason. That's After true. you folks told me. I'm guessing I'm not going to find my people alive. Hell, Javi. They killed your niece. Shot Kate. For all we know, your brother could have been behind it. And even if it wasn't his idea in the first place, if he knew about it and didn't stop it, that shit can't stand. I hate to admit it, but there's a chance he gave the order. If he didn't know it was them, if he was just trying to get payback for what was stolen. 
It's possible. What was he like when you knew? You guys get along? He seemed happy enough to see you up there. At least at first. Things between me and him were complicated. Some days we'd be at each other's throats. Other days we could shoot the shit for hours and still find stuff to talk about. So he's a moody son of a bitch, huh? If your brother knew anything about what happened in Prescott, he's got to answer for it. They all do. I owe that to Conrad. I'm not just going to let things slide. I've never really been an eyebrow kind of man. But people died. We need to even out the scales. We need to look like we're playing along with their rules. Go along with what they say. For now. Then, when the time is right, that's when we demand justice. Hey. Hey. I would have been here sooner, but I had to take care of... something. Come on already. Kate's asking for you. Maybe you think it's okay to keep a lady waiting. What about the rest of my friends? They're not invited. Hurry up now. Sit tight, guys. Looks like the rules don't apply to everyone, huh? That's right. Some people get out of here early. Others stay a long fucking time. Trent, just drop it, okay? Just calm down. This one. Javi, just go. I'll be back as soon as I can. You know that. Thanks. Trip's a little bit of a hothead too. And what does she mean? The way we acted. I have never portrayed that we were an item. The game's given me plenty of choices. Not interested. them for now that doesn't sound good we have a process our own way of doing things your guys better not have a problem with that things don't go well for troublemakers here I hope that's clear of course not we're happy to be here it's good to see you alive brother same here Where are we going? Kate asked for you. I thought you'd want to check on her. Listen, Javi, Gabe, he told me some pretty messed up things. Things I need your help wrapping my head around. What? I can see you know what this is about. He told me you lost Mariana. Just a few days ago. I'm sorry, David. She's... She's gone. It's strange grieving for the same person twice. Like losing something you didn't know you had. What was she like, Javi? She was so little when we got separated. Who did my little girl become? got along well. Her smile kept me going through a lot of rough times. That must have been nice. How? How did she die? Tell me how it happened. Please, I need to know. She was just standing there, minding her own business. She just found her lost headphones in the dirt. She was smiling. And then someone put a bullet in her head. What kind of animal would just open fire on her like that? An animal with your mark. My people aren't in the habit of killing little girls. David, I was there. They shot Kate too. Ask your buddy at the gate if you'll believe me. Max was a part of this? Hi, Max. Fuck. What, are you losing control of your people? I need Everything you remember. Bastards knocked me out and threw me in their truck. I got away. 
way near this town, Prescott. The same assholes attacked us there. Their leader flooded it with walkers and, and tear gas. Leader? A crazy bald guy with a beard. Badger, what the fuck have you done now? I'm gonna handle that stupid son of a bitch, okay? Do me a favor, keep this to yourself. The politics here, they can get messy. I thought you were the boss. There's four of us that run, Richmond. You need to impress the other three. Or you'll be back on the road by morning. Interesting. Try not to stir things up. You and your friends could have a very short stay. I can be impressive when I try. I'll follow your lead. Just don't get cute. I run security here. But it's not like my word is law. This shit with Badger doesn't make things any easier. Ah, look at her. Fresh meat. Ava, this is my brother, Javi. The baseball brother? <laughs> no shit. What are the chances of you turning up on the doorstep? Welcome to civilization. It's a pleasure to meet you, Ava. Oh, is it now? <laughs> you didn't say he was a gentleman, David. That's because he's not. <laughs> Ava's my right hand. If there's anyone you can trust in Richmond, it's her. Okay. That woman, the fucking soldier. She was the first person I met up with after you and me got separated. I never would have made it without her. Gabe said you went back to the house at the start. I'm sorry I never found you. We waited for you for three months. Eventually, the house was overrun and we had to move. Why didn't you come back? Mama and I got routed out of the city on the way to the hospital. It wasn't long before she... Poor Mama. I couldn't get back into Baltimore, so I hooked up with my old unit. We thought we could build a safe zone outside D.C. After what happened to Mama and everyone else, I thought you were all dead. But you were taking care of them, weren't you? Somehow you found a way. I'm not gonna lie. I never thought you had it in you. We took care of each other. We all had each other's backs. You've changed, brother. It took the end of the world. But you finally grew up. This is where they're treating Kate. Don't get comfortable. We're not staying long. This makes things really interesting. Like the way they have like this politics, they got four leaders? Wow. Hey. Hey kid, got everything you need? Uh, yeah. This place is like a resort. Check it out, Javi. Noodles in a cup. <laughs> we need to get you some real food. Stat, turn you into a soldier. <laughs> Javi, I'm glad you're okay. I'm a lot better seeing you. Damn, it's good to have you back. Look at this family. Look at my wife. Isn't she the most beautiful woman alive? Come on. With the lights off, you could mistake me for a walker. A damn fine walker. Gross. You're a lucky man, David. We're all lucky. Uh, what, you okay? Uh, my... oh, shit. I'll get the duck. I'm fine. I just needed to talk to you alone. I'm scared, Javi. More than I was the whole time on the road. Even when I thought I was going to die. Everything inside me screams to get away from here. These people are killers. And David? David threw his own brother in a cell. Let's just get you better, Kate. The facilities here... I don't care about facilities. We 
We did fine without them before. You didn't have a ruptured spleen before. These people nearly killed me, Javi. David's people. Have you forgotten, Mari? Of course not. It's always been you and me on the road, Javi. That's how we've made it this far. Please, promise me we'll go back to that. The first chance we get. This place. It's a cage. We can't let ourselves get locked in. It's going to get bad if we stay. I hear you, Kate. But we can't just turn our backs on this place. On my brother. Javi. We have to try to make it work. I used to say that about my fucked up marriage. Guess it still applies. Whatever. Just please. Please don't leave me alone for too long. Feeling better? How you doing, sweetheart? David reported some pain. It's less now. Strange how it just comes and goes. Doesn't seem normal. I think she pulled her stitches when she sat up. Her stitches? I doubt it. But pain often comes in waves with abdominal wounds. Hmm. <laughs> I'll give you something to take the edge off, in case it comes back. Truly superlative work. I thought I'd have to operate, but all she needed was IV fluids and some antibiotics. How did you find someone with skills like these? A wound like this kills nine out of ten. Whoever did this really knows their stuff. That would be Eleanor. One of my friends you threw in quarantine. Well, she's no use to anyone there. We should let her out. I'll vouch for her. I'll have Ava bring her here. I want to meet this Eleanor. I'm sure she'll be an asset to our community. You can't just cherry pick who you want. Why don't you let them all out? Can they all perform surgery on a dirt floor with a pair of pliers and no anesthetic? There's your answer. Javi and I have to go meet some people now. See if we can't prove he's worth a damn. We're gonna take real good care of you. Okay? Send my apologies, David. I won't be able to make it. Feeling okay? Fine. I just want to keep an eye on my patient. The others know my vote is with you. Come on. All right, guys. We're gonna end this one here. Uh, <clears throat> I don't. I don't know. I'm curious. Do I even get a choice? Do. Like, I've been trying to make all the choices that we aren't a couple with David's wife. But maybe we don't even get a choice. Like, maybe they just hooked up beforehand. I don't know. But that's where my vote is. I never wanted to be in a relationship with her. And I don't want him to be in a relationship with her. But maybe we don't get a choice. Maybe they're just in a relationship behind David's back. So, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what happens in the next one. Kesmir out.